today we are going to show you the best 3D printers you can buy right now. We have analyzed the market and listed these 5 best 3D printers for you. For more amazing tech product reviews and suggestions please subscribe to our channel. We will try our best to present you with the best tech products that you can buy now. Product links in the description box in this video will be covering 3D printers including what they are, why you may want to choose them and some of the best options out there. Number 5 Sovel SV07 The Sovel SV07 is a 3D printer that has been gaining a lot of attention lately. It is a great option for those who are unable to afford the latest and greatest Core XY printers. The company has taken a solid Ender-style bed slinger and added a dual Z-axis and a Volcano-style hot end, as well as a massive fan to it. They have also given it Clipper, which makes it a very fast, very loud, and very affordable 3D printer. The SV07 can cruise at 250mm per second but can hit 500mm per second in draft mode. While the acceleration rates are not listed, Clipper has pegged it at 8,000 mm per second, which is much faster than most bed slingers can handle. This is possible because the SV07 has Clipper's input shaping routine to cancel out the vibration. We were able to print a perfect speed bench in 22 minutes using its default settings, as well as several other nice prints. Because it has a direct drive, the printer can even handle TPU when slowed down. The SV07 is a great example of how Clipper can be seamlessly added to any printer. Previously, Clipper was strictly an aftermarket upgrade requiring a Raspberry Pi to handle the computations. Instead of stuffing an expensive Pi or similar board inside the machine, Sovel swapped its normal touchscreen for a Clipper pad. The pad handles all the extra work and gives you an easy-to-navigate 5-inch touchscreen with fluid. Number 4 Anycubic Cobra 2 The Anycubic Cobra 2 is an entry-level 3D printer that offers a low price, ease of setup and use, problem-free operation, and solid print quality. It ticks all the right boxes and is also one of the fastest 3D printers available. It is priced at just $279 and is easy to use thanks to its unique extruder that is designed to print as fast as possible. The printer is compatible with the popular open-source Cura program, but it also comes with the Prusa Slicer app that offers tons of editing options for both new and advanced users. This Anycubic printer is perfect for newbies, thanks to its bargain price, easy setup, and fast operation. In our tests, it produced nearly misprint-free output, but the print quality was unspectacular, with detailing that makes it a less-than-optimal choice for intermediate or expert users. However, it still serves as a fine low-risk first platform for those getting their feet wet in 3D printing. Number 3 Anchormake M5 The Anchormake M5 is a newcomer brand, which is an offshoot of the established charging gadget maker, Anchor. The M5 is its first market offering and does a lot of things well. It is easy to set up, has super-fast print speeds, and has some eye-catching features. The M5 gets extra consideration as the video and customer support for setting up, replacing parts, and running the machine are second to none. This would be a fantastic beginner printer for that reason alone, if not for the mid to high end price tag. Some of the features admittedly need a little polish, such as the clunky PRRI slicer and AI print fail detection. However, there's so much potential here that we're itching to see how things get patched by firmware. The sky's the limit with this brand, and we will watch its future upgrades with much interest. Number 2 Anycubic Photon M3 Premium The Anycubic Photon M3 Premium lives up to its name as a premium printer. It boasts a high-resolution 8K screen and light turbo 2.0 feature that help deliver exceptionally high-quality prints. In our tests, the printer produced perfect fine details on our models. However, we encountered some faults with Anacubic's Free Photon Workshop slicing software instead of the printer itself. This printer is not just for creating small, finely detailed figurines. It has a large maximum build volume of 9.9 by 4.9 by 8.6 inches, 250 by 123 by 219 millimeters, that allows for the creation of massive prints. 
With its 1.35L resin vat volume, you won't need to pause the printer frequently to refill when creating larger models. The downside of having a larger print volume is that the printer itself is also large, with dimensions of 25 by 13 by 14 inches, 630 by 330 by 350 millimeters, and it can be challenging to find space for it in your garage or workshop. Additionally, the USB port is placed awkwardly on the right side rather than at the front. Before purchasing the printer, we suggest measuring the space first and adding a couple of extra inches to the width to account for any USB sticks. However, if you have enough space, the $639, around 595 pounds, price tag for this printer is reasonable, considering the quality it delivers. While it may not be the most budget-friendly option for beginners, the Anycubic Photon M3 Premium is an excellent choice for experienced makers looking to upgrade their 3D printing setup. Number 1 Creality K1 The Creality K1 is the new flagship in the 3D printing community, and it's looking to win you over. The entire community has fallen in love with high-speed printers, and Creality has introduced a speedy, fully enclosed Core XY machine in response to the competition. It boasts a maximum print speed of 600 mm per second, paired with an acceleration rate of 20,000 mm per second. With good quality, it can print a speed bench in 15 minutes, and its normal print speed is around 5 times faster than old-school bed slingers. The K1 retails at $599, which is the same price as Bamboo Labs Open Frame P1P. How does it compare? Well, in our testing, the K1 is just as fast as both the P1P and P1S, with a better interface and the ability to avoid unreliable cloud printing by using a USB stick or your private LAN. The K1 is a Core XY machine, a speedy style that Creality hasn't tried since the ill-fated Ender 7. This machine is twice as fast and, with the help of Clipper's input shaping, can produce excellent quality at speed. It has an all-metal hot end with a bespoke volcano-style nozzle, a Sprite direct drive extruder, and an enclosure for handling temperature-sensitive material like ABS and ASA. It's one of the few plug-and-play 3D printers on the market, arriving 99.5% assembled. All you need to do is unbox and unpack the printer, and like its rival at Bamboo Labs, it can calibrate itself. Here is a comprehensive rundown of the top 5 3D printers that are currently rocking the market. Each of these machines has something unique to offer, catering to a variety of needs and preferences. Whether you're just starting or looking to upgrade your current setup, remember that the best 3D printer for you depends on what you're looking to achieve. Consider factors such as precision, speed, detail, and of course, your budget before making a decision. Don't forget that links to all the products are in the description below, along with any discounts or coupon codes I could find for you. If you have any questions or if there's anything else you'd like to know about 3D printing, feel free to drop a comment below. I'm always here to help you navigate the exciting world of 3D printing. Don't forget to hit that like button if you found this video helpful and subscribe for more insightful content on the latest in tech. Share this video with your friends and fellow tech enthusiasts, and let's keep the 3D printing community going strong. Thanks for watching, stay creative, and I'll see you in the next one.